Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to Astroneer. Today, I want to take a look at the tethers which has been in this game since forever. And uh, yeah, if I understand them correctly, they might help us breathe a little bit better. Well, not better, just we can go explore a little bit more along the way with tethers. I think what they do is they extend and you can attach yourself to them and you can breathe easily so we just created some tethers using some compound and if we look over here in the instruction manual it says t to place tethers all right so let's see if we go around here aha uh -huh. so this is a tether it does give us an indication okay it's not doing anything uh, let's place it here okay so it did light up well the cable did what happens if we place another one around here somewhere hmm how about I don't know here yeah hmm also nothing oh, this is interesting oh look at that we just attached to it but we're not attaching to this one Hmm, what's going on? We pick it up and move it a bit closer, maybe? Ah, there we go. So, we're not attaching this one, but we are attaching to that one. Okay, now we're attached to the base. Okay, let's just put this stuff over here. Just want to do some inventory management real quick. So maybe we have to craft more tethers or whatever. Now I'm just trying to figure out how does the tethers work. Because aren't, why aren't we attaching to this one? Hmm. Okay, let's see if we move. Place another one maybe. I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. What's going on? Pick you up and move it closer. Okay, so if we do this, pick it up and put it down, then it the rope or whatever becomes more visible. And now we attach to that. But we're not attaching to anything else. Or the rest of the tethers. Hmm. Let's move it this way. Uh what? So, they light up now completely. Interesting. Let's see if we can... Uh-huh. Okay, so we are attached to this one now. Let's see if we can grab that one. Place it as far away as can. Like there. Ah, okay. So, it might be a bug or your base needs power or something to make them work them these tethers ah okay so now we can go ahead and place them okay now I understand completely how they work this means more exploration we can go further without worrying too much about oxygen now that is good to know that is really good to know okay Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a cut in here real quick and see if I cannot go explore and find some aluminum because I want to go ahead and build stuff. And thanks to the tethers, we might go way further than we can. So, yeah, I'll bring you guys right back as soon as I found something interesting. See you guys in a bit. And welcome back, peeps. So... I delve into a cave and I found a corpse. There's a corpse here. And a backpack with titanium. I'll take that, thank you very much. What is that? Fuel. Hydrazine. Aluminum. Dynamite. And oxygen. It's currently empty. Ah. Oh. Okay, how do I get rid of the backpack. Just click on a corpse again. Yeah, there we go. 
Huh. All right. Ah, oxygen. Uh. Ah, there we go. Let's just place a tether right here. Ah, now there's light. So yeah, that is actually a body lying there. Oh, poor guy didn't make it. That's sad. That's just sad, man. That's just really sad. I mean, this is a cute game and all, but that's a bit brutal, don't you think? It's just kind of realistic in a sense, but yeah. Alright, so let's see if we cannot go any further and see what is next or what is going to, you know, pop up. Or maybe there's more corpses or maybe a crash ship or maybe the elusive aluminum. Yeah, let's plop you down there. Hmm. Okay. Not seeing much, though. It's fun exploring this way, but it does take some compound and some crafting time. Yeah, I'm not really seeing any aluminum. I don't really know where to find aluminum at all. I mean, there are caves you can explore. There's that ship crash, which we did explore in the last episode. But where do we find... Oh, my. Oh, my. There was some massive amounts of frames gone. But yeah, I don't know where to find aluminum at all. Really, I don't know. Maybe next episode we should go into the caves and see if we cannot find anything there. Well, there's something that way. I think it's the crashed ship, but... I'm just trying to see if there's any indication inside the caves or around here somewhere. I don't know. I don't know how aluminum looks like. I don't know what. That's just resin. Really, I do not know. Sounds like a dark dog barking. Dark. <laughs> a dog barking. And some really cool stuff around here, and especially in the caves. There must be something. Something interesting. Some kind of rare material known as aluminum. I don't know. Could be. What is... Um, Alright, let's get back to... The oxygen. Otherwise, we will suffocate once again. And that might be bad. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. This guy doesn't jump very far now, does he? Oh, here's some oxygen. Suck up all the oxygen. Yeah. And there we go. Nice. Alright, so we don't have any power. There's nothing left over there. Just putting away the NASA vacuum cleaner. And let's see if we cannot go to... Whatever that is. It looks like a huge deposit of something. Just don't know what. It's got a giant arrow on it. What is that? Risen? Yeah, that's resin. Okay. So these are giant resin deposits. Hmm. Alright. Gonna explore a little bit more. And I'll bring you guys right back. And welcome back, peeps. So, I decided we are going to continue on building and see what else we can craft and whatnot. I am collecting some compound real quick. Because there is some things in the making. So let's go back over here to our base and I think we need one more, yeah, one more compound. Let's craft up the smelter. Now I do not know really what to do with the smelter. I have no idea. But we can make a generator because we found that one aluminum, one piece of aluminum on the body in the cave. So now we have a generator and it looks like it takes organic material. Okay. So let's see, where can we place the generator? What will be the most important? Hmm, smelter. What can we... Let's put the generator on you. And do I have any organic material on me? Doesn't look like it. They should be around here somewhere. I put some... That's resin. 
Ah, organic. Alright, let's put you there and fire up that Jenny. Okay, so... Smelter is gaining power. And... Yeah, let's go ahead and extend some things, build up the base a little bit. There we go, there's some resin for you, my friend. Alright. And maybe a little bit more this way as well. Let's get that resin, put that on there, and start building. Cool. Alright. Oh, wanted to show you guys something. If you press tab, we can sit in this thing. <laughs> I didn't know that. It's so, so cool. So, uh, that might be some kind of vehicle in the future, but we still need our aluminum. Maybe we should smelt some, I don't know. I really want to play around with the smelter and see if we cannot make aluminum. That'd be really cool. So, in here we have some resin, which I will just quickly collect with my NASA approved vacuum cleaner. There we go. Anything else? No. Low power, though. Okay. Resin. Resin. Ye. Yeah. So now we can add a new thing to our base. I don't know what, but... We will see. Alright. Coming up to... The building point. Build me this thing. Haha. <laughs> Printer, we already have. Trade platform, needs aluminum, needs aluminum. The vehicle bay, we only have one piece of aluminum. Smelter, research, fuel condenser. Yeah. Is there anything we can craft with the aluminum? Let's just go ahead and put that over there. And just put the power up there. We might need it in the future. Titanium, we can put over there. And... That stuff we can put there. So, I wonder if there's anything we can craft right now with the aluminum. A wind vane. Hmm. Now, what does a wind vane do? Well, there's only one way to find out, I guess. Let's go ahead, craft that up. It looks like that thing that uh, meteorologists use to determine the wind and stuff. Okay, I, I can't... Why can I not... Click on the thing? Can I click there? Um, is it on me now? Oh, there we go. Click on that. Where will you stick? Uh, 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 frame lag. Uh. Alright, cool. So we got ourselves a wind vane. Interesting. Don't know what that does, but... Alright. Anything else? Thevers requires a compound. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else, guys. Hmm. Alright, so, yeah, I think this is going to be the end of the episode, guys. Thank you so much for joining me here on Astroneer. Hope you guys did enjoy today's episode. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. And before I go, I just want to say happy holidays, Merry Christmas, and happy 2017 for you guys in the future. Because this weekend, no videos. And I'm going to spend some time with my fiance on Christmas and trying to take it easy. And I've still got some part time jobs that need to be done. So, yeah, thank you guys. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.